Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Happy New Year. It's 2019. Fresh start, reset, chapter one, whatever you want to call it. For me, it's a restart. I'm pressing the restart button. Okay, this is a movie. We are restarting it. All right. Um, 2018 was interesting. 2018 was not good. It was weird. It wasn't bad. It was weird. Um, 2018 was a trying year for me. I created a lot of memories, um, but I also went through a lot emotionally and mentally, and it was draining, but it was rewarding. But when I say it was draining, your girl was tired. I was tired. Um, so I was ready for it to be over. And I am so excited for what's in store for 2019. I sat down today and I wrote out my intentions. It took me two hours, but I'm really proud of what I came up with. Um, I put a lot of thought into it. The reason I'm looking down is because I'm looking at the journal that I wrote my intentions on. And I'm looking at what we're doing today. So today we are doing a vision board. Um, what is a vision board? A vision board is a physical representation of your dreams. Um, vision boards, from what I know, um, help you when you want help manifest those dreams. You know, with having it somewhere that you can see it every day, it kind of provides that motivation, that drive for you to constantly go after what it is you want out of life. Now, vision boards are not magical. You cannot just put stuff on it and expect it to happen. Um, but today's video is dedicated to vision boards. I'm not perfect at this. This would be my first and complete vision board. And the reason I say first and complete is because I've created vision boards in the past, but I've never completed them. Meaning I've printed out the pictures. I've cut out the words. I've cut out the pictures. I've put a few on the board, but I never, ever finished the board. And it would just sit there and collect dust. And I would just like get rid of it every new year. But this year that is not happening. I created a diagram. I have thumbtacks. I have a cork board. Um, I have scissors ready to show y'all. Like, I'm ready, okay? This board is going to get done today. And I hope watching me create my vision board pushes you all to create one for yourself. Um, and I just pray 2019 is a great year for us. Let's get it started with this vision board, okay? All right, so welcome back. This is my setup for my vision board making. Here I have my thumb tacks. I have a really hard time pronouncing this without my accent taking over. Like if I say it fast, I don't even think it makes sense. Um, thumb tacks. All right, I got my thumb that tacks, Lord. And I have some of my printouts. Um, most of the stuff that I wanted for my vision board I could not find in newspapers or magazines or books. I really don't cut up my books. So yeah, I couldn't find it in any magazines. So while I was at work, cause I got free ink. I printed out a bunch of stuff and I've been cutting them out. And you can see that some of them are already on my board. Um, this is what I started last year and never finished it. So we're adding to what we had last year and we are gonna finish it today. Why? Because we are manifesting great things. For 2019 and beyond I don't think I dab correctly oh my god um anyways so uh this is embarrassing it says 2018 vision board this is how you know I did not finish what I started last year and it's really sad but I'm willing to share with you all because I'm not perfect no one is perfect so it was a diagram of what I wanted to do with my vision board in the center I have you above it I have spirituality Right here, I have relationships. Here, I have hobbies and creativity, such as YouTubing and Instagram. Here, I have travel because I really do want to get into traveling. Like, it's not something that I say I can exactly afford right now, which is why I'm putting on my vision board, because I'm going to make it happen. I have career and education, finishing school, uh, meaning school, finishing school, and starting a career. Um, self-care because all this cannot happen if I am not okay mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually, and all of that great stuff. And then I have here finances and health. Finances, I got to get rid of my debt. I'm not really deep in debt, but if I'm going to go to physical therapy school, I know that's just going to make me accumulate more student loans. I got to get my student loans under control before I do that. So 
That's why finances is here. Also, I need to become more of an adult. I'm 28 years old. I need to save more. I need my savings account to look amazing. So that's why we have finances. And health, y'all know I'm a health nut. I love everything health. I'm in school for PT. I love health. Um, so we're gonna ignore this eight. This is our 2019 vision board diagram or outline. Um, it's not fancy, it's chicken scratch, but it helps. So let me just take these down and show you what I have right now. So currently, this is what the board looks like. Um, some of these are not on yet, but this is what it looks like. So we have my spirituality corner. Um, we have me and we have traveling. We have my education and career here. We have finances here. We have health here. And self-care is gonna go somewhat down below. I already cut out pretty much everything it is that I want to go on my board. Now, this is the thing with the vision board. It's never complete. If you ever come across something else that just sticks out to you and it is something that you want for yourself, cut it out and put it on the vision board. Make space for it. And vision boards do not have expiration dates. So if you happen to accomplish something on your vision board, if it doesn't have a limit, keep going. If it has a limit, take it off and replace it with something else. That's the great thing about vision boards. They're not exactly goals that you check off. There are some things, it's basically your life on a board. It's physically your life on a board. If you want to get married, put a freaking couple on there, you know? I do want to get married, so maybe I should do that too. Let's get started. So I had to redeem myself from that previous dap because that was not a dap. Um, and I don't want my black card revoked. So I redeemed myself. Do not check me in the comments. So I'm about to start post, I mean, pinning everything on my board. So we're gonna kind of like fast forward through this because I'm just gonna be running my mouth. Um, but once I get through with the left side, I will come back and show you guys what it looks like. So I'll be right back. Welcome back. So I said I was gonna come back and show you all the left side, but I actually finished the entire board. Um, I got so caught up in it that I just decided to do the entire thing. And to be quite honest, it looks amazing. I'm proud of myself 
I'm proud of the board. I also stopped to eat. So let me not lie. <laughs> but yeah, I went to go eat. But my board looks amazing. Um, I'm going to show you guys now. Who's excited? I am. You guys okay so the book all right I'm back and the board is actually complete I said I was gonna come back and show you all the left side but I did the entire thing and to be quite honest it looks amazing like I don't want to like pat myself in the back but <laughs> it looks amazing I'm amazing um and it's amazing to see what I want on a board <sighs> I'm excited to share with you all so Without further ado, is that how you say it? For, for, without further ado, without further or, or do, for, whatever, okay? Drum roll, please. And voila! Look at this beauty. Look, look at, look, look at it, really. Like, look at it. It looks amazing. We have spirituality. We have career and education. We have hobbies and just everything that I do on and off social media. We have finances, we have traveling, we have love, friendship, well-being, fitness, health, all that good positivity stuff. And we have, I think my favorite on this entire board may be the finances and traveling part. Um, and the education part. Okay, the whole board is my favorite. I really do love it. And I'm so happy that I actually finished this board. It's such a great feeling. Um, it's just a, a vision board, but it's really a great feeling because this year is about completion. Um, this year is about me finishing everything it is that I start. And I have already accomplished one of my intentions for this year. And I feel amazing. Um, my vision board is complete and I really, I really do feel amazing. This is like, this is amazing. Oh my God. Ah, this is great. Okay. So let me just give you guys uh, background information on a few of these. Um, if you follow my Instagram, you know, I post my devotionals every morning. My goal this year is to read my Bible every single day. It's to, um, have a heart of gratitude, chase after God's own heart. It's about um, walking by faith, not by sight. It's about reading my Bible more. I want to get my um, credit score back up above 700. This year I hit, last year I got it to 710, but then it dropped back to the 600s because I got lazy with paying my bills on time, but I'm not doing that anymore. I'm going to follow Dave's Ramsey, seven baby steps to being debt free. I have debt free here because my goal in life is to be debt free. I don't do credit cards anymore. I have one credit card and I plan to pay it off this year and be done with it. Um, so I'm going to follow this to help myself. I'm going to build my savings account up. I just currently started a savings account over last year um, and I'm not touching it. This is strictly to save up and this says save an additional 3000 I already have about a thousand of my savings. It may not be a lot to some people, but that's a lot to me. My goal is to add 3000 to that by the end of this year. My career in education, I, when I started looking up physical therapy schools, I found one school and it did not leave my mind. And that was Emory Henry College in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, for some reason, this is the school I want to go to. Um, it's very competitive to get into. My grades are not great. I'm retaking classes so I can make myself more competitive, make myself more um, wanted. I'm not really wanted, but I just want to make my, my, I want to improve my grades so that if I do apply to the school, I know I'm giving it my all. And I know that if I don't get accepted, it's not because of something I did not do. Um, I doubt myself a lot when it comes to my education because I'm not that smart. I really don't like school, but I really love physical therapy. So I'm going with it. My sister told me to put this on my vision board and keep it there because to be quite honest, I don't know what the future holds for me. So I'm going to keep it here. If I get into this school, all praise be to God. If I don't, I'm still going to be good. I just want to get into PT school and get my DPT. And right here, she says she wants the DPT. <laughs> 
Um, here we have traveling. We got this beautiful dark skinned girl with her yellow bathing suit on. I hope you guys can see it. I wanna be on somebody's beach and not in the United States this summer. I'm gonna be there. Self care is right here. Um, I have self care over here. Um, I went through a lot mentally this year and dedicating some time to taking care of myself is something I plan to do this year. Um, I have a bedroom here because I'm still trying to revamp my bedroom so it's a place of solitude. It's my sanctuary. It's my peace. So this right here is just a reminder that I have to keep working on it until it becomes what I want. Love Live, we have two people holding hands. I can't say I've ever been in love in a relationship. I've never been in love. And I actually do want to experience that one day. So I do have that on here. Um, body positivity um, is a huge thing. And I love Hyatt on Instagram. She is amazing. I actually have her here with one of her Nike campaigns. And she is just a motivation for me. I have Serena here. I have Akinwale here because they are my two um, superstars. They're just amazing. Their physique I love. Um, my goal is not really to weigh a certain amount of weight. It's to get my abs back and they remind me that it is possible for me to get my abs And I'm totally gonna do it. So, um, that's my board up here. I have influencer I don't really consider myself an influencer, but who knows I have a plaque for YouTube Make sure you subscribe so I can get to my 100k and get this silver plaque I have a camera because I want to do more recording And I just have some amazing sayings here. Love yourself first you have to tell yourself you're enough. Be yourself, whole self. Be your whole self. Um, just a lot of amazing things. So yeah, this is my board. I hope watching me make my board helps you all create yours. Um, vision boards are great. They're not magical. They don't do the work for you. But they do remind you that whatever you have and whatever you want. Actually, whatever you want out of life is at your fingertips. Um, and you can have it. You can have it in so much more. And I'm excited to see how I can manifest everything that is on this board throughout my lifetime. Um, I pray to God that I live long enough to see everything come to fruition. Um, so here is to a great 2019 and beyond. Um, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and maybe even share. Thank you guys so much. And once again, Happy New Year.